Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. This is old captain. Old captain coming to you live from Lake St. Clair. Max and I haven't been out to the steel bridge in probably a month. Had a lot of things going on at home, but things are getting better now. Health-wise, with Ramona's hip, she's improving every day. So we got a little window of time today. It's November the 26th, currently about... That's approaching 50, but Max is, he's shivering just a little bit. He's got about the 50 shiver on, but got a ton of covers up there where he can burrow down when he wants to. The sun will be out good in a little while. Gonna be 60 something degrees here in a bit. So how can you not come out here on a day like this? I mean, just look at that, isn't it? It's just beautiful. I mean, we don't care if we catch a fish. Are you kidding me? We'd like to. But um, brought some reading material, got some live bait, got some minnows, gonna try a little bit of uh, side fishing other than cat fishing, so gonna be dropping a minnow or two down. Got some cup brim, got some chicken. So um, who knows, we might even catch a fish. We may even back into one, who knows, we don't care. Anyway, we're just glad to be out. We're going to be out here probably three or four hours. We'll check back in with you in just a bit. So I hope you have a great day, and thanks for joining. It was having Thanksgiving dinner at work. All right, folks, this is the old captain coming back to you live from the steel bridge. In fact, we're under the steel bridge. Yeah. Came over here to see a friend. I got a, I got one fish so far, pretty good size one, not a monster by any stretch, but still a, I didn't get skunked. Mm -mm. I've been studying my son's school lesson a little bit. Max is holding down the bow. But our guest today is Mr. Mark Anthony, Anthony Little, if you will. But uh, Mark sells cars over at um, Nissan, at the Children Nissan. If you need a car or if you need to learn how to catch a fish, he's the man to see. Mark, tell us a little about yourself and about the history of this bridge. Well, this bridge has been, well, I'm Mark Little, I'm an Edenton native, and uh, I've been fishing here since I was a kid. So I'm 43 years old, so you can imagine the size of the fish and the history coming along with it. And where we fish at, there's an old bridge in the water. And I guarantee you, if you can get in a boat any time of the year, you can catch some nice cats, you can catch some crappy, and a whole slew of whatever else is swimming out there. Well, but if you don't believe me, come on down and join me and Mr. Hart. <laughs> I guarantee you, we'll prove you wrong. <laughs> well, one of the things that I, I love about fishing is meeting people. And Mark and I have crossed paths several times up on Crooked Creek and down here at the bridge. And he's always just a joy to talk to and uh, learn from. And, and I just enjoy people that enjoy doing this sort of thing. But Mark, we... Wish you the best. Hope you catch some more today, and we will talk to you soon, okay? Oh, yeah, and by the way, if you need a new car, come on down to Children Nissan <laughs> to see me. There you <laughs> go. That's for Mark Anthony. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Take care. <laughs> well, folks, it's the old captain closing out for today, November 26th. Man, it's got to be 63, 64 degrees. Max enjoying the sunshine. We're heading all the way across the lake, back to the house. Had a good day, got a good chance to talk with my friend Mark Anthony Little, and wound up with two fish. Got two nice cats here across the boat. We'll put them in the water and drag them home. So, um, hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Thank y'all for your prayers for Ramona. She continues to get better, better and stronger, and continue to remember her. Happy Thanksgiving, and we will see you soon. See you next time. Take care.